Okay, well here's my little Tromo that I built to go on top of the gold cube. The battery box there. I'm at a gravel pit, just testing it out. There's a trauma there. Just use a seven inch, some kind of stove pipe or something. And then one eighth screen. And it's hand operated. So my problem I found out is my maiden test here. First test is that um, I need more spray bars or maybe don't make the slope so steep, but I think maybe more spray bars will be the solution because it's not um, uh, flushing over all the small stuff out. So I get I still get some small, little small stuff coming out the end, not going through the screen. So I think maybe more spray bar, more holes in the spray bar. I think is the solution. I got a lid, um, thinking that oh, it might get sprayed from the spray bars, but I'm not. So I guess I don't really need that lid, but. Uh, let's keep it on there. And this is um, just an angle bar from a, another uh, a trauma idea that I had. I just kept it on there and worked out pretty good. Kind of holds it in place. And then I cover the slot. Or, uh, this hose here. And then I just, yeah, you can see there, I, I don't know if. Um, I'm using the stock pump that came with it, and I'm not sure if it's going to be working too hard now. The spray bars and the extra hose. So I'm not sure if I'm getting enough volume, but I don't know how I'm going to test that out. I guess I could just fill a bucket up, or uh, put a bucket underneath and time how long it takes to fill it up. And then I can figure out if it's pumping enough water. I guess I'll do a little test run here for you guys. Okay. There. The reason I did uh, the big 7 inch is uh, so to have room with the spray bar to put a, my scoop in here and turn it over. That's why I went that big. comes out pretty quick, eh? More spray bars, and maybe lowering the spray bar closer. I guess maybe that won't work, but maybe more, more holes in it. Yeah. You don't have to turn this thing fast at all. It's a nice slow turn is all you need. This is the second one I made. The first one actually I built to uh, fit in one of these buckets. And then I just filled the bucket full of water and um, it actually worked really well. But I wanted this because it's like a one step process. So I'm going to go and spend another hour or two here before they close the gate. They let me come here at the back end and play. So um, there is historically gold in this area. It's all glacial till here, so, but it's known as flower gold, so I'm not really expecting to find any unless I. Spend a couple days here, maybe. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. Get some more here. Put that in there. I'm gonna get it from this side. See if you can see. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put maybe some angle brackets in here and to prevent everything from sliding down here. 
it'll stay in there and mix up some more, I don't know. Uh, so it's working, I got to stand there and I have to clean out of my little trough. Okay, that's what I wanted to show you guys.